Boss and Nerd Show here and today we're unboxing the new Star Wars Smugglers Bounty featuring the theme of Star Wars Rebels. So as you can see we have um, Ezra on there I think is his name. Of course from the Star Wars Rebels show and stuff. So we're going to get some new Rebels Pops um, out of this box. At least hopefully new ones because I have all the old ones up on the shelf. So hopefully we'll get something new out of here. Um, but first up as always we have our patch and a pin. And so the patch has Zeb on it. Which, of course, he's kind of like the Chewbacca character. And it just says Rebels. I thought it'd say something else. And then we have the pin, which um, has Sabine's um, man like Mandalorian helmet. It's hard to see with the light. But Mandalorian helmet there on that. And, of course, it's got whatever language that is on there. It doesn't say anything, though. And this says, Behold your share of Smuggler's Bounty. So I've never noticed them having that on there before. But, so we'll get into this now. Um, so first off we have our shirt. Again, it's another pop t-shirt as they always have. So let's see what's on this one. So I like the colors that they have on it. And so of course it's just the whole um, group there of all the rebel characters and stuff. So of course we have Hera, um, Kanan, Zeb, uh, Chopper, Ezra, and Sabine. They're all around on the shirt and stuff. So that's kind of cool. Then the whole Star Wars um, Rebels logo there for the show and everything. So that's kind of a cool shirt. I really like those colors they chose on that. So that's awesome. The next up, um, we'll go ahead and start with this one, I guess. And so it is a Chopper Hikari, which Chopper, of course, is the R2-D2 type character, as you can see. But he's kind of a um, different shape and stuff. Uh, but this is kind of cool. Um, of course, we got um, another... Uh, one that's the exact same color as the Darth Vader one we got a few months ago. Um, it's all like the black color or whatever. It, you can kind of see through, probably not on the camera, but in here you can kind of see through that it's all hollow and it's really like squishy. Which I always thought Hikari's were like a glass or really hard plastic. And because I always heard they were super fragile and stuff, but this doesn't seem fragile at all. It's like almost like a... Um, like a toy ball or something like that. Just like hollow and you could like bounce it or something. But it's still cool. It's hard, like I said, hard to see the detail with it being all black and stuff. But it's just a um, chopper, as I said, which is really cool. I wish he had his little arms hanging out, but he doesn't. So that's awesome. And then we have our two pops for the, or we get two pops this month. And this one I do remember was advertised, but it's a Darth Maul. And of course, this is, I believe, the second Darth Maul that they've made. Um, I have the original one on the desk behind me, which was from like episode one or whatever. But this is um, his new, like, um, Rebels looking version where he doesn't have the shirt on and stuff. And he's supposed to have metal legs, but he's got boots and stuff on, kind of hiding it and stuff. But as you can see, he looks um, a lot more evil than the old one does because of all the paint, um, increased paint detail and stuff that they can add on to and stuff. But of course, he has this classic double lightsaber there, which is awesome. Actually, this one looks different because he has some, like, um, points sticking off of it. It's kind of hard to see. But that looks really cool. That's awesome. As I said, I forgot they did advertise that one it was going to be in here. But then they have another one, which I did not know, and it's a Captain Rex, which is really, or maybe it's not. I'll say this is the first one um, clone uh, figure that they've made where they've actually like labeled it or something. But I forgot they did do ones a while ago. They were, I think they were exclusives or something, um, but I never had any, or I don't have any of them. But this is, of course, an unmasked one of Captain Rex, and so he's from... Um, the, of course he was in the prequels and then in, in uh, the old Star Wars Clone Wars show that was on Cartoon Network and stuff and now he's in Rebels as an old man so that's why he has the white beard and everything and he's turned of course against the Empire and stuff and is with the Rebellion type thing and stuff and so it's really cool so he still has his old or somewhat old Stormtrooper or Clone Trooper sorry outfit on um, so he's got the blue and everything um, so it still has somewhat like um, what looks like that on and then of course no helmet or anything like that and then he's got two um, identical guns in his hands so that's a really cool pop I really like that and that's the kind of stuff I like to get from this box and hopefully they like don't make any other versions of it and stuff and so then we have our card showing the um, characters and stuff and so um, the one thing I did notice on here so everything again is the same as like exactly what you see but it looks like you could have possibly got different colors of chopper so it looks like there's an orange red white gold and then the black one down there like I said it doesn't really say if you could get those 
but they're all packaged on here, so maybe they're going to... Well, they do all say have the exclusive sticker, so maybe they are. And then, of course, everything else is the same. And then our month or next box is going to have the theme of... Uh, uh, can't think of what it's called. A New Hope, that's what I'm trying to say, because it's the 40th anniversary of A New Hope's release and stuff. So that's going to be really cool, and so obviously we're going to get some New Hope character um, and celebrating the whole 40th anniversary. So it's going to be a big year for Star Wars anniversary-related stuff. So it's super cool for a um, Star Wars fan and stuff. But that's going to be it for this Smuggler's Bounty Box. If you enjoyed, please leave a thumbs up, leave any comments you have down below, and hit the red subscribe button to see more, and we will see you next time.